One of the things that's unique about mental illness is that it starts early. You're talking about disorders that 75% of the time start before age 25. These are the chronic disorders of young people. The enormous personal cost to the individuals who are stricken by them for life, as well as their families, their loved ones, the cost to our nation in terms of the medical care required and the economic loss is enormous. But we're beginning to put enough pieces in place that the picture is beginning to emerge of what a disease like schizophrenia really is all about. Once we have that understanding, we can begin to get a much better approach to developing the next generation of treatments. Mental illness is now poised to jump into this zone of really exciting progress, a molecular understanding followed by molecular therapeutics. That's where we need to go. We've got a whole new generation of people coming into this field who are extremely well trained, know how to ask difficult questions, and they know how to attack them. What's happening with this announcement today, with all the talent uh, that is being brought to bear on these conditions, we are poised. Uh, and I would not have been able to say that a decade ago. We're poised for real advances here. I'm impatient. Everybody listening to these words is probably impatient as well. But that impatience is being met now with resolve. We're not just going to wring our hands, we're going to do something.